y'all so today is saturday and today is micah's birthday party but right now donovan is about to come over and we're about to go look at some apartments right now i just have on this little off the shoulder top that i got from PacSun, these jeans that i also got from PacSun, and i'm currently wearing my um fenty slides because they're like the easiest things to put on. And then I'm gonna just carry this bag today. Um, I got it from Urban Outfitters online, if you're wondering. But yeah, so we're just gonna get this day started. I just wanted to say what up to y'all and all that good stuff. Last night to like make my hair like this, I just flexi rotted it. I put in like the big, here I'll show y'all. I used eight of these all over and then I just brushed out the curls. So I like how it looks and like I said, this is the Sassy Mitchell um, Eurasian exotic wave hair. But anyways, let's just get on with the rest of the day. Um, my mama has set up everything for Micah's birthday party and all that stuff. So that's exciting. So that starts at 4. So I'll be back b before then. And also, his birthday gift, I think, just arrived outside. So let me go see. It's a floor wet? Don't walk through. It's wet. Oh, is the, can you get the package outside? Thank you. So, Micah's package is here. I got him a bunch of clothes and then I got him some shoes. I'll go ahead and show y'all what I got him just in case it's hard to like see it later. Micah's probably not even gonna care about the stuff that I got him because he's a baby. <laughs> so, okay, so first I got him some all whites, some mid top all white forces. So, they're cute. He gonna need these. These will be essentials. For the spring summertime so yeah then i got him these vans which are so cute so yeah i got him these vans they're so cute i love them they're just the cutest and i got them from the van store and then i got him some clothes from h&m which i haven't even saw myself so let's be surprised and see what's in here let's see what micah got i think donovan's out there i think i hear his car so i got him these little shoes um, and I got all this stuff from H&M, I don't know if I said that, but I got him these little shoes. I got him this little outfit, just like this little shirt, and it has suspenders, and they're really cute or whatever. I just texted and told him to hold on. And then I got him this little linen shirt. Yeah, this is a Micah haul, y'all, so these jeans. Donovan just texted me with a straight face because he thinks I'm not ready, but I actually am. I'm just vlogging, so he can wait. And then these little shorts, this striped shirt, this little outfit, it has a bow tie. Y'all know mama loves them in bow ties. And it has some, sh it came with some pants too. So he can wear this to like church and stuff. These shorts, which I think are super cute. I think they'll look real cute with his vans and stuff. This little shirt trying to hurry up so if it seems like i'm rushing these shorts this metallic little band tee um just a plain white little t-shirt this little white button up the last thing these little shorts which are really cute so yeah it's his first birthday y'all you know i gotta get my little bro right but yeah i gotta go so i'll talk to y'all later you look cute in your nice cash outfit Donovan's like the casual one today. I'm not really dressed up by any means, but I feel like I look. Really? Nah, I feel like I just look more like dressed because my hair is like curled and I feel like I'm about to get a prom, so. I'm wearing slides. I'm wearing slides. A regular shirt that I was typically wearing, some jeans. The hair just makes me look more. I'm sure that y'all are wondering if me and Donovan are about to be living together. And what, what what's the answer? Yeah, no, we're not gonna live together. I'm literally going with him to look for. Oh, don't say it like that. You really about to get punching your throat. <laughs> what I do? Nah. I just said no. <laughs> How you want me to say it? No, we're not. We're not gonna live together. I'm so sad. Yeah, exactly. Verbatim. Anyways, so yeah, I'm going to just go look with Donovan. You know, give him a female touch or whatever see what i think if i think it's an appropriate living arrangement see the vicinity of the area make sure ain't nothing near that that i'm, I'm literally ODing right now but yeah so um we're going to look for donovan we're not going to be living together are you excited yeah you said you were excited um i'm more excited to look at like furniture stuff to honestly uh, yeah so I might go with him to 
to a couple of different places if he invites me to go help him look. I'm excited, you know, uh, for him. So, yeah. But no, we're not living together. We're not ready for that. Um, I'm very, uh, I'm a very, <laughs> like, I'm a very, what is the word? You know, I like being by myself, kind of. So, like, I get those moments. Like yeah, I like my space. I like, you know, of course, when I graduate, I'll be visiting him and all that stuff. He'll visit me. But yeah, we just don't need to live together right now. Um, I don't think if we stay together, I don't think that I would want to live with him for a, a while. Maybe not until, like, it's time, that time, you know, that time that not time or something. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about waiting? You know, like, but obviously I'm a very go with the flow type of person. So if we do decide to live together before then, or if that was to happen, then that's what that is, you know, but we're not rushing it. We cool and we'll be able to see each other. But yeah, me personally, I'm gonna go back and live with my mama when I graduate. I've thought about getting a place like this whole semester or last semester, like when I graduated, this whole time I've basically been set on getting my own spot, but I talked to my mom about it more and my mama thinks, you know, that nothing is wrong with me coming living at home, saving money because my mama really wants me to buy a house whenever I like move out and stuff like that. She really wants me to purchase a home. So she feels like it'll be much easier for me to save money if I'm living in her house so I can actually save to get my own house instead of using money to um, pay bills in an apartment and also trying to save to get a house. So, you know, I don't have no problems with that. I don't feel like, of course, my dream spot is not my mama's house. I'm 23 years old, but also I'm fortunate enough to be able to stay in my mama's house if I want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't got no problems with it. Y'all know I love my family. I'm not out here just trying to be a baby or anything. And you know, I might move out sooner than later because my room at home right now is like, very small especially for me like I've grown out of that room for sure so one of the main reasons why some of them I don't want to live there is because my room is just so small and I feel like I don't have space but I don't have any issues with my mama you know what I'm saying so I just feel like you know that's probably what I'm gonna do um, yeah so I'm ready to move up yeah Donovan is it's ready because it's been a year since I like been out of school so I just been like kicking it with the parents and it's like nah bro yeah. gotta do work you know donovan's an only child and the house is big donovan's room is huge and low-key like i can take your spot because <laughs> i'm just like you know i feel like that's a cool little living situation mm -hmm. so it's not, i don't feel like like of course he has no problems at home or anything like that he just wants to be a man and get out of his parents house which is understandable he did graduate college um, almost a year ago so you know like I don't think um, if anybody is out here graduating college or whatever and you're like oh, I don't want to move home I don't think anything is wrong with that honestly like if, if somebody has something to say then it's really like it's not even any of their business but um, yeah I know a lot of people that go back and live at home with their parents and you know do whatever they gotta do and that's fine like because that's what I'm about to be doing I'm really not in no rush to up, pay bills like who want to pay bills all the time <laughs> nobody yeah exactly like especially if my mama is allowing me yeah, to do that free, free. yeah and wow. because it was like literally my it was my idea to move out my mama has never been like she's always been like you can just stay here blah blah you know so i mean and it, like i said i'm gonna be saving money to really like move out big girl status you know what i'm saying so i'm not really pressed about it i'm cool we'll see what happens but yeah this is like a long clip of me talking, but yeah, I just feel like Do I, I should, yeah, you can. but I just feel like, I guess I should update y'all on since me and Donovan aren't going to be living together, living together. Um, but I still have been pondering the idea of getting my own place still, because I'm just like, yeah, so let me know down in the comments below, because I kept forgetting what I wanted to ask y'all, but let me know down in the comments below. Um, anybody who has graduated and went back and lived at home like how that was for you um how it was for you saving money wise um yeah was it a good decision to stay at home for you do you feel like you should have moved out just let me know like y'all's opinion on the situation um you know like 
because I'm about to graduate. I'm about to be in the big boy world and it's like really gonna come at me. What do you think? Do you think I should move out? I, I feel like you should you should stay and then save up whatever do you think. I mean because like yeah, what's the risk? So honestly, I would pro I would probably be at Donovan's a lot hanging out, you know, if he lets me come over. Um, probably not. <laughs> but yeah, I'll probably be there a lot anyways with him, but be cool i'm excited you know i'm excited for you to get your place i'm excited to like pick out all of his furniture and decorations i love it you gonna have probably like this much say like whatever get out yeah right donovan donovan yeah okay you feel like i feel like you're trying to like i'm yeah, kidding i'm, like, I'm kidding i was just kidding i was just joking i was just joking i don't want to decorate your whole thing i want it to be you know yours i don't want it to look like it's mine honey um because it's yours Ain't nobody paying. Ain't no bills being paid with these coins. So decorate it how you want. But yeah, so I'm excited to like see what he picks out, and then if he picks out something ugly, be like, yo, that's not a good look, and he'll be like, okay, you're right. But anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling now because it's probably been 30 minutes. Um, so yeah, I'll talk to y'all in a bit. So we're in here, and this is I guess like the waiting area, and it looks pretty nice. There's a pool table. Oh, this is cool like all the stuff over here of how the apartments will look and there's what looks to be a gym over here oh sorry yeah you i'm not trying to get you <laughs> there's, a gym. there's a gym in here so this is cool just the details. Yeah. I like this. And then the pool and stuff is out there. like way bigger the studio is like too small like it's cool but this is nice so this is the guest bath over in here y'all this is a two bedroom um and then the bedroom oh i like this thing this is nice this is cool um so this is the bedroom and then a pretty cool closet this is the, this is the guest room cool and then this is the kitchen the living room and that's the master. This is the master. This is cool. It's a good size. Yeah. Here. And then this is the master bath. Yeah, no, it's cool. Linen closet. I like this arch thing too. Okay, so we just looked at the apartments and they showed us like models. So they showed us a studio and a two bedroom, or she showed us a studio and two bedroom. And the studio was like cool, like it was cool, but like, it's too small. yeah. And then, um, yeah, is like one person. yeah, but it was really nice though. I still did like it, but you know. And then the two bedroom was really nice. I really liked that. Like, yeah, I like the setup a lot. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, that was cool. So she sent she gave you like a list of two yeah. bedrooms and one bedroom. Yeah, the one and it's cool that it has a garage attached to the two bedroom. Does it have garage attached to the one bedroom too? Um, yeah, some of them. The okay. ones that are what the hell? <laughs> what? <laughs> Literally just ran the red light like so hard. It was not stopping. Like what? But um, what'd you say? But 
Um, yeah, they do have a garage for the one, like the one in LA. It was has a garage. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think a one bedroom would be cool because I mean, I feel like a two bedroom, like that two bedroom is huge. Yeah, a two bedroom would be cool, but like, what would you do with the second bedroom? It's like, because I mean, you have a living room for whatever you would want. You know, it's like your own spot. So like, but yeah, the two bedroom was really nice. Though. But if it's like a one bedroom that's still pretty big and like the yeah. same type of thing, that would be really nice. I really like those apartments though. Shoot, I'm gonna come live out there. Oh <laughs> we're gonna come. We're gonna be living in the same complex. <laughs> Guess we'll see. Stay tuned for living with Donovan or not living with Donovan because I'm not living with him but what, what should we call the series? Uh -huh. Apartment hunting. Apartment hunting with Donovan. Yeah. Apartment hunting with DB. I like that better. Apartment hunting with DB. 